Now, cases of personal information leaking from institutions legally obligated to collect data are a growing concern in Kenya. To mitigate this, the Office of the, of the Data Protection Commissioner is urging data controllers and processors to come up with mechanisms of safely discarding data that is no longer needed, needed so as to protect the data pro subjects. Now, the team from the Office of the Data Protection of a commissioner as was in Makueni and Elgeo Maraquet counties. And here's a story as filed by our reporters Nancy Okware and Timothy Kipnusu. During the sensitization forum in Makueni County, Kenyans sought to know how safe they are as they issue their personal data in this digital era where data is the new oil. The Office of the Data Protection Commissioner alluding to the growing concern over data breaches, especially by digital lenders. What are, what are the terms and provisions that you see? When you go through them now when you are conducting investigations, we see that you allow them to access your contacts. In case you don't pay the loan, then you allow them to call your mother, your father, your boss, the mother in law. This has been partly attributed to the failure by data subjects to read terms and conditions, hence giving access to private information such as contacts unknowingly. If at all you being asked to provide your ID, your email address, phone number, your date of birth, ask how this data is supposed to be used. And if you're not given an answer, do not give this person your data. If you're a data controller and a processor and you are uh, collecting information from minors, there should be an outside procedure on how you will be collecting that information and how you will safeguard the information. You as a data subject, you have the right to uh, access your personal data uh, where you can go to an organization and tell them uh, this is what I want to know about my data and uh, they should process and they should adhere to your request. In case of a data breach, a data processor and controller is required to notify the Office of the Data Protection Commissioner within 72 hours upon knowledge of the breach for action. The data subject should also be notified of the breach in writing within the shortest time possible. Reporting from Makweni County, I'm Nancy Okware, and I now hand you over to my colleague Timothy Kipnusu, who was covering a similar forum in Elgeo Maraquet County. Thank you, Nancy Okware from Makueni County. Yes, indeed, the Data Protection Commissioner took their campaign dubbed Data Yangu Jukumulangu in Elgeyo Marquette County with a clarion call to area residents to protect and safeguard their personal data so as not to fall prey in the hands of fraudsters. It is during the forum that the data processors and data controllers were urged to adopt practices that will help deal with the data breaches how as a data controller or a data processor how you need to uh, ensure that uh, the data you handle uh, actually uh, is well kept and uh, maintained imagine all owns yes yeah they wipe this account you know what they do uh, once they have your, your number they will call you incessantly when a big as you want Elgeo Marako Deputy Governor Professor Grace Cheserek, who was in attendance, revealed that cases of Kenyans being duped are on the rise. In Elgeo Marako, we like sharing data carelessly through social media. I think now we have learned today that it is criminal. It is now a crime. She said the county is committed to ensuring strict adherence to data protection laws. It is very critical that we learn this and we embrace not only at the personal level, at our organizational level, and we also protect each other as a county government of El Geo Maracuete. You should not be denied the right for you to access your personal data. I'm happy that act has come in place and we want to operationalize it, we want to interact with it and see how best we can safeguard some of this information. And that boy may leak kwanjia moja ya walifu ama niambaya tuweze kufata huyu ameleak hiyo information ametumia fisivyo. Timothy Kipnoso for Prime Edition Elgeyo Marakwet County.